U.S. author Lisa M. Davis believes the Duke of Sussex will attend King Charles III's coronation but Meghan will give it a miss, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have gone from America's golden couple to pariahs in the space of a year, the author of a new satirical novel about the pair has claimed. Lisa M. Davis believes Hollywood A-listers and politicians are increasingly distancing themselves from the pair while suggesting in the UK King Charles is playing a good long-hand strategic game where his son and daughter-in-law are concerned, her self-published book, Meghan and Harry's Alternative Universe, dates back to the barrage of publicity the Sussexes generated with the release of their Netflix series on December 8, which in turn inspired her to begin sharing her thoughts about the pair online, Ms. Davis, who is already working on a second book, says she was largely indifferent to Meghan and Harry until the aforementioned date, however, she has now revised her opinion, branding the situation a clear remake of the story of Icarus who, like Meghan and Harry, and fueled by hubris, flew too close to the sun. She told Express.co.uk, What I have observed is that on December 8, 2022, they were the golden couple with the Midas touch that had every door flung open for them and hordes of groupies, from the LA royalty like Ellen and Oprah to the unwashed masses that saw them, especially Meghan, as some Jean Dark noble figure fighting for the poor and oppressed as she chit chat with Beyonce on her private jet. But by the time I finished the book, they were shunned and ridiculed as pariahs, and it is getting worse for them. She continued, I think the Americans see them very clearly now. The movers and shakers that they glommed on to politicians, movie stars, humanitarians, movie moguls, publishers, billionaires have dropped them. I think they are deemed toxic. I think Meghan and Harry are toast. Burnt toast. Since the Netflix series and the publication of Spare, Harry's controversial memoir in which he claimed to have been physically assaulted by Prince William during a heated row about Meghan, King Charles III, Harry's father, has evicted the couple from Frogmore Cottage, and there is widespread speculation about whether they will be invited to his coronation on May 6, Ms. Davis said. He clearly casts a long shadow and after waiting 50 years is going to do it his way, but, having said that, I admire the king and he definitely is playing a good longhand strategic game with some pretty harsh penalties, it is hard to read him, but I try not to criticize him because I think the way he the family and the British people have been treated really badly by these two. The king is motivated by a desire to be a good father first and foremost, she suggested, adding, I think but for what is driving him, they would really be cast out and I personally think they should be, they are going to end up in obscurity, greater obscurity than that of Edward VIII and Wallace Simpson. As for whether they would attend the king's coronation, she said, I think at least one of them has to in order to retain the last vestige of anything that they can still cling to. I think you will go alone. As for Harry's future relationship with his father, she said, maybe the king and Harry can salvage something. Other than the king, I can't see anyone else bothering with them. Meghan and Harry's alternative universe is available on Amazon.